Hey everyone, welcome back to Simply Share Share. This holiday, I'm doing things a little differently and I'm putting my own twist on our regular traditions. From fresh decor combinations to spicing up the menu, I've partnered with Tostitos, who sponsored and partnered with me on this video to show you some simple ways to brighten up your holiday and turn up the heat at home. I've got some staycation ideas that you will definitely want to try and make sure to watch until the end of this video to learn how to make my Filipino inspired Kamayan festive platter, which I promise will be the showstopper on any holiday table. Let's get started. Normally, my husband and I love to travel. With our backgrounds, I'm Filipino and Michael is Colombian, Peruvian. Our winter vacations can go as far as Asia, South America, and even Hawaii. This year, we're putting a pause on traveling, but I thought it would be a fun idea to transform our living room into a tropical lounge, which you can easily do to create your own staycation. To get this tropical vibe, I'm using what I already have at home. So a lot of whites, pastels, and winter greens and then just adding some tropical botanicals like monstera and palm leaves. Make sure that the greens have the same color tone so they work together. To create a simple citrus centerpiece, just use some lemons and limes at the bottom of a vase and add eucalyptus greenery and winter berries as accents. Instead of the usual evergreens, I thought let's go with a eucalyptus garland with some fairy lights just to add some softness and keep things feeling light and bright around your fireplace. Okay, how cute are these ornaments? I ordered faux lemons, I've got lime and orange slices as well. I just added a wire hook to the slices and there you go, you've got some citrus sparkle. And since you are on a roll, you can match your decor with how you wrap your gifts using palm leaves and colorful ribbon. One of the Filipino traditions is to have family style dinners called kamayan, which is set on banana leaves. All of the food from rice to meats, it's all placed beautifully on the leaves where the whole family can enjoy all the foods at once. No plates, no cutlery necessary. Here's the twist. I'm going to set up kamayan, but the cool part is that it's actually divided onto separate trays so that each family member gets their own. As a kid, I used to love sitting in front of the TV with my TV dinner, just keeping it casual. So this is just a fun way to bring back all of those memories and basically have all of my favorite things together. Since we're keeping things festive and fun, we are starting off with a Hawaiian dip holiday tree. I'm going to be using Tostitos restaurant style tortilla chips and a hint of spicy queso tortilla chips, I love saying that, plus Tostitos medium salsa as the main event. Here's what you'll need. Cream cheese, sour cream, pineapple, sliced ham, bacon, green onion, cilantro or parsley would work too. All of the ingredients are chopped and diced about a quarter of an inch or so. You'll also need 10 by 15 inch trays, one for each person, banana leaves, a mini cookie cutter like this star, and parchment paper. Let's get started. All right, all you have to do is set your tray onto your countertop, then take your banana leaf, which you've washed really well and dried with paper towel, and then you're going to trim it to the inside of your tray. Now that you've got all of your ingredients chopped and ready to go, it's time to have a party. It's time to mix things up. Add a tablespoon of each of the ingredients and mix really well. Take your parchment paper and form a cone. And if you want, you could use tape to hold the paper in place. Honestly, this doesn't have to be perfect as long as you get the right height. I'm going to measure out six inches and then trim off any excess. Once that's done, you're going to fill the cone with the cheese dip and refrigerate for at least 30 minutes. Now it's time to take out your tray and your cheese dip. We're going to place the tree wherever you want, whether it's centered or off to the side, and then unwrap the tree. It's like the big reveal. Apply a thin coat of sour cream to the tree, then decorate with all of the remaining ingredients and just have fun with it. All right, so we just have our pineapple left to add a lot of brightness to our holiday tree. One little pro tip, feel free to use chopsticks. As you know, pineapple is slippery. And every tree needs a topper, like this mango star. How cute is this? Then add tortilla chips around the base of the tree and just fan them out so they look more sculptural. The best part about using Tostitos tortilla chips is that they are always ready to serve and they're so versatile. 
and I can pair them with so many different flavors. So you're going to have the mango pico de gallo, salsa, and some guacamole. And remember, a hint of spice makes everything nice. I am so excited about this tray because it brings so many flavors and memories from all of our cultures together in one mini meal. All right, the holiday dip is done. The tray looks super cute and delicious. And now I'm gonna show you how to create the ultimate kamayan in the living room. You can also finish decorating the tray with some colorful veggies and maybe even some flowers. Then line up your trays in a row on top of some greenery and your kamayan is served. I'm bringing the outdoors in with this lush leaf trellis, adding some contrast with festive poinsettias in white and bringing in pops of color with dragon fruit, grenadillas, some lemons, and pineapple. And to really get in the mood, don't forget to turn up the heat and dress for the occasion. Ooh, thank you. Cheers. Good girl. And as a special surprise for our staycation, I've loaded up all of our old vacation photos and videos so that we can enjoy them while we eat. Look! Yeah. Look! Look to you! Alright, so just have more fun when it comes to decorating this year. And I hope you get a chance to try my combined inspired holiday festive platter, whether it's an appetizer or the main event. I promise you that you will just definitely enjoy the process and make this holiday amazing. A huge thanks goes to Tostitos for partnering with me on this video and make sure to check out the Global TV app link in the video description below. So you can watch at home for the holidays for more recipes and holiday ideas. And of course, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to Simply Share Share, like, comment, and share this video. And I will see you in the next one to help you get things done simply. Happy holidays from my family to yours. Can you say happy holidays? <laughs>